Okay everyone, welcome back to Darksiders 3. I just needed to check if I used up all my attribute points, which I did. Alright, let's see. We're gonna go and continue on. Thought so. In this new area, not even continue on, you begin it, because... The scar. There is something familiar about this place. One oh, yeah? Is nearby. He and I have unfinished business. How in the hell does she know? Not for long. All right, that's very convenient. To be fair, I didn't even check if these guys were enemies or not. Which, of course, they are. All right. For a second, I forgot how to play this game. <laughs> um... You know, it's just switching between all these games, and they're similar as well, when you think about it. I don't think so. I've not seen the, yeah, the counter-attack for this weapon yet. You know. One thing I do have to command this game on, is that it does keep enemies fresh. Um, talking to you, Neo. Uh, that's one of the, I think one of my main criticisms of Neo. Which again, I will give my final thoughts on the game. People suggested that I should do a montage, which I might do. Uh, I don't know how many like crazy moments there have been in Neo. Probably less than some of my other series, but... Yeah, one of my main criticisms of that game is the lack of enemy variety. Which is, again, it's severely lacking. Um, oh. How convenient. How very convenient. My other main criticism... What the hell are these fools doing? My other main criticism being that the game sometimes is just like... Way too insanely hard. Going beyond even what a... Normal Souls-like should be. God damn, this... This weapon still feels like it deals so little damage. I don't know, it's weird, especially compared to... You know, my new weapon. Which does hella damage. And it's not even, like, upgraded. Alright. So yeah, you do need the stasis hollow for this. How very convenient. I was just about to say, um, how long does this last? It don't last too long. Alright. So we really gotta just like haul ass as soon as we, you know, as soon as we uh, hit it. Gotta hit and run, you know. But yeah, that's the thing, like, this game, it's good on the environment, environment, not even environment, enemy variety. Uh, where this game falters kind of is a little bit in the technical department. I think if they maybe, I don't know, reduced some of the graphics a little bit, or, I don't know, just like adjusted them, I'd rather take, you know, worse graphics for the sake of... Uh, not having to load and all that. Oh, he creates a clone. I thought he's like someone the little helper. I don't think so. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, that, that was funny. So yeah, I'd rather personally always emphasize performance over you know, graphics. And when I'm playing Fortnite as well, that's why I think Fortnite is so shut up on on Switch. And honestly, I've been playing a lot of Fortnite on PS4, and going back to Switch uh, feels a little bit strange. It's still fine. You just gotta get like used to the lower frame rate again. Which is, you know, a little bit jarring. Because... I was wondering if I could knock him in. Alright. Stasis hollow. 
hit this bitch. If I can lock onto it. What? What? Excuse me? Are you kidding me? I slid into the middle. I made a lot of weird what sounds. You what, mate? That was that was pretty insane. All right, last try. This is gonna end up like the alligator in Resident Evil when I was playing a few days ago. Holy shit, that was bad. I died to the stupid alligator like way more times than I should have. I'm gonna be honest with you. Which, you know, if you haven't checked out my Resident Evil series, you should. It's really fun. I stream it. And damn, that is a good game. I swear. Final attempt at this. To be fair, I'm not sure how much of it that... How much that was my fault. You know. But we don't want to go too DSP. DSP tries it, you know. Or low tier god, depending on which game you're talking about. Although, I'm gonna be... <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, there is like something weirdly entertaining about low tier god. Like, I enjoy his videos uh, and his rage compilations probably more than I should, honestly, because he is a fucking asshole, but <laughs> I don't know, there's just something about him uh, where DSP is just uh, unpleasant, I would say. Alright, line this shit up. Targeted. I don't. I am I not. Am I not getting something? Do you have to trap? Do you have to trap a rock in the middle like that, and jump on that? Cause. Fuck. All right. Okay, you know what? I promised live gaming, but actually, I'm gonna cut out that last attempt because it's just getting way too ridiculous. There we go. That's all I wanted. I don't know why it took so goddamn long. Don't ask me. Hopefully, there ain't gonna be too many more puzzles like that. Hey, weird beetles. What we need here is for me not to get fucked up by them is what we need. I knew the only thing I need that I needed was a giant hammer. Let's go box squashing. Perfect as well. Yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna cut out that last stand, which means you missed some talking points, namely regarding YouTube URLs, but yeah. I was just saying, I had this channel since 2011. I haven't stopped, I haven't started up, no, actually 2010, now that I think about it. But I just wasn't uploading videos, or not like frequently. No shit, I had this thing earlier, because I was uploading all the music videos, like covers. In like 20, not even 20, like 2009. Yeah, I remember. Holy shit! I holy shit! It's been long, 10 years. 10 years. It's a long time. What up, boys? These demon bros ain't got shit on me. The frame rate though. Okay, maybe I'm gonna take back my roasting of this hammer weapon, cause... Yeah, you better... Better not block that. It's been working out pretty well. Maybe not. 
What the hell is that? Oh. I like how that applies the slow effect. Cool. But yeah, it's been way too long since I've had this YouTube. But hey. It's kind of the thing with all most social medias. If you had them for a, if you've been around long, you know. It's kinda of weird to think about. Am I just glitching up here? I feel like you're not meant to <laughs> feels like you're not meant to be up here. Cool. Alright, the boy's smelling a puzzle. Yeah, we're gonna... I know what to do. That ain't what you do. Oh, this is not a... Well, that, that was stupid. It's not... I, I thought it was like a proper... Deep-ass pool. But it ain't. I don't know why she doesn't lock on some... Whoa. Actually, that shouldn't matter, should it? Because... Yeah, we're immune to fire damage, which we should be. I mean... Horseman of the Apocalypse. Fire damage. I, I, why is she not... This is one mechanic that has kind of eluded me throughout this entire game, actually. Let me use this last shitty ass. There we go. Final shitty ass small healing shard. Yeah, I kind of got that, boys. Oh, I know what you have to do. We're gonna have to hit it. With... What the hell? Let's just get an email. Yeah. I'm a smart fella. Some pro puzzle solving action right here. Okay, that only works. That's what I get for trying to be creative. Don't ask me what the hell that did. Cool. A very much appreci appreciated game. We don't have to do that again. You know what? I know. I just know what to do. Okay, maybe I don't. But this works as well. How much do you want to bet there's some treasure down there? But whatever. How are you not dead? See, I, I don't want to, like, sound ungrateful game, but a Volgrim checkpoint would very much be appreciated right about now. I had to check. I mean, I just had to. Because that is a big-ass demon. I think we fought these things before, right? I'm a pro at this game. Increase fucking... Dodge windows. Just what I needed. What a bitch. I think I'm liking this stasis hollow the most. I just want to keep it fresh. So I switch sometimes. For sure it feels like the most... Well, versatile, I would say. And it's application. Now, before we go there... Gotta get the treasure. Can't miss the treasure, right? There's gonna be some other puzzle here as well. Actually, we've not been... We've not had a puzzle for quite a while that really kind of... I couldn't figure out. I saw the Volgrim checkpoint. 
I saw it. I saw it. We're gonna have to do some stasis freezing, right? See, like, again, this is what I was talking about. I'd rather have, you know, lower graphics, but more... Like, thanks, I know how to level up. So patronizing. Let's get a level. And let's get one large healing shard. Yeah, this game does the Devil May Cry style um, inventory system where the more you buy from an item, the more expensive it gets. Man, I'm kind of hyped for Devil May Cry 5. That game is looking good. All the Devil May Cry's I'm a fan of. They're just like very solid. It's crazy like when you think about it that hack and slash, I would say that in general hack and slash games tend to be generally very high quality. I know there's some shitty ones out there but when you think about like the past hack and slash games that have come out, really most of them have been well received and uh, like very solid. Them boys know how to make hack and slash. What up? Are these guys making a jacuzzi? Is that what they're doing? Alright. Mallet of scorn. We have... Oh. Well, let's upgrade this then. I mean, yeah, why not? Let's get it. Let's get it. This hammer's got to do some more damage now. I swear at this point I buffed the hell out of it. All right, let's go back to the car. I wonder if I'll be able to well, probably not be able to get to the boss these areas tend to be generally lengthy but this this is the last sin right besides uh the weird faced lady yeah she's gotta be the end boss unless there's like some secret other end boss which this games these games usually have you know you had the destroyer and then the fuck what was the name of the angel You know, you know who I'm talking about. Not Absalom, because Absalom was Darksiders 2. Okay. Secret treasure? Yeah, but before that. That is a bottomless pit. I thought it was water, and... Good thing I did not jump into it, because... That would have been... I was like, you better grab that ledge. Oh, oh, okay. That was not as... That was not as... Oh, wait. I was gonna say, I thought there would be more to that. But there might be, because it looks like you can climb up at the top. Fuck, no you can't. Never mind. Never mind. Twice I thought I was discovering something really cool. I was in on the secret and I wasn't. What up? You're looking pissed. Oh shit. He blew his horn. Yeah, that's more like it. I'm talking about like my little dinky ass whip shouldn't be dealing as much damage as or more damage than a fucking giant ass purple hammer how is that not a perfect dodge that was a perfect dodge in my eyes. Thank you. <laughs> Look at... 
Okay, I did not. I did not actually realize that blew them away like that. Literally blew them away. I think one of them actually died. Okay, I see a magic wall, which we have to turn. I can already see. I see the solution to this puzzle. I see it. I swear this is the worst enemy in this area. The most annoying one for sure. Except, you know, you're dealing with a pro dodging expert here. Okay. This area looks really cool. Again, it is like the... I think it might be the same area, right? No, because that was called like the Ashlands or something in um, Darksiders 1. I mentioned that, right? That that was probably my favorite area of the game. It looks like you could float down there, but... You know what? Let's not... Let's not play around with that. No carnival, no games, you know. How very convenient. Do a little bunny hop. Okay. We could also go to the other side. See what's over here first. Aside from secret treasure that... Yeah, I was gonna say it's probably an ambush too. Can you... game. Can you lock on? Hold on. I know the solution to that. Well, actually, no. I was gonna activate my Wrath ability, but then I realized that it's kinda... Kind of a waste on these things, right? And yeah, it is. Alright, chill out, chill out. We're getting rescued. It's so weird, you know, that she's like basically the same size as a human, you know. Like you'd think these being like supernatural death dealing monsters, they'd be a little little taller. And you know, war is uh, war is a little bit more on the bulky side. And even death just feels weird saying that, you know, but that's what it is. It's like when you're in, if you're playing Kingdom Hearts, it just feels weird saying that it's like, you know, Mickey and Donald and all that. Shit, I screwed up. Oh, thank fuck. Yeah. Um, damn. All right, well, I screwed up. Yeah, I remembered this from the first game as well, that you can... Ah, I almost had it. So, let's try this again. Please tell me that counts. It counted, but I screwed up the jump. I'm so stupid. I keep screwing it up. Like, that jump is not difficult. But anyways, what was I talking about? Oh yeah, Kingdom Hearts. Which the third one came out. Uh, I honestly... Maybe I'll pick it up. I never finished. I have the HD collection on PS3, but I never finished them. Uh, they were okay. It's just... 
the combat system didn't hold my attention. That was my main problem. Just kind of got kind of a little bit repetitive, and of course the other issue is the the story, which the story of King of Kingdom Hearts is pretty much absolute goddamn chaos. Oh, that dude is. And they're just like straight up roasting each other at this point. That's how you develop camaraderie with your weird uh, BDSM inspired demon buddy. Because you know they got a thing going on. Like, you know they're gonna be fucking by the end. I can almost guarantee that. I'm only kidding, of course. I still, I still hold out that she's gonna turn out to be evil, because these things do work for the chart council, and they're established to be bastards in the first game. You know, that honestly might be like the final boss of this entire series, the chart council. But I don't know if there is even going to be a fourth game. Which, again, I've said this before, but I'm really hoping there will be. It would be a shame not to finish this series at this point. And I'm really hoping it's not going to be uh, six years away. That was sick. Go flying. These guys don't stagger though. Oh, shit. That's gonna put me way back. I just realized. Yeah, that is. Alright, whatever. We'll make some progress here. I have to do this stupid puzzle over again. Okay, okay game, fine. But yeah, again, back to the original thought. It would be, I think, a great shame if this series never got finished. And just one more game. I'm hoping, I'm hoping it's sold enough that they're gonna make it, that it's gonna be profitable to make a fourth one. Hopefully soon, like, again, not six years from now. Because... That's kind of crazy. Oh, all these motherfuckers respawn as well. I didn't think he would respawn, honestly. Hey, what can I do? Hammer time. Look at him just like shrug it off. I think he ran out of helpers. That move is so satisfying to pull off. I actually have some heals though. Okay, now he's going into combat. No, he's not. I thought he was taking out his hammer weapon. Come on. Ouch. This is a motherfucker. He deals a lot of damage. I don't think so. 
There ain't even anyone you can call. Oh, do they just appear if he blows his horn? That's hella unfair. Enemy summoning is not part of the plan. Cool. Alright, hit that. Hit that by the Outlast. Not Outlast, just Out... Outcast, that's the name of the band. Outlast is the game. Don't know why I said Outlast. I've had that game on my mind. I've said this in my Resident Evil series, but I never actually ended up finishing that game. Um, I'm okay with horror. I don't mind jump scares personally too much. What gets me though is the being chased thing. And Outlast, the entirety of the game is you being chased. Oh uh, yeah, I wasn't... I mean, I like the game, I can appreciate it. Papa bless, you know, appreciate ya. But, yeah. It was scary. That's why the tyrant freaks me out in Resident Evil. Like, objectively, if you think about it, the tyrant is like the, the least scary thing. I mentioned this before. It's like a fedora wearing, uh, trench coat wearing giant zombie. Doesn't sound scary, but it's like menacing chase is kind of freaky. And the fact that you can't do anything about him, I think that's the other as aspect of it. These, these are bitches, these demons. Throwing their little spears. But yeah, the, I feel like... Now that I've leveled up a little bit, I'm stronger. The combat has become a lot more fun. First of all, I have more variety in my my equipment. And all of them have a purpose. Second of all, my invincibility window has gotten larger, which is very convenient. Plus I have more health, which means I can actually take some damage. You know. Don't ask about the frame rate. It's not your video. The frame rate is kind of low in this area. Okay, give me my shit back. All right, hardcore puzzle action. Okay, how are we going to do this? We gotta get there. Okay, let's see how First thing we need to do is let's see how this behaves. Okay. Oh, something is blocking it. Interesting. Oh. Yeah, yeah there it is. question is, how do I get to it? The thing that's blocking, unless... You gotta... Hold on. Oh! I knew there was some secret shit there. I know secret shit when I see it. Okay, I'm about to die. Holy shit, that was a clutch heal. That was right as I was about to get fucked up. The clutchest of clutch heals. Okay, so this spider ball track. Interesting. Let's leave that alone for a second and we'll take the safer one. 
Yeah, this one, this one looks okay. Doesn't look like you have the potential to die by, you know, misplacing a jump. How very convenient. Just like in Metroid, like spider ball tracks. And that was so, that, that game is so much fun. Naisu. And the fucking ramps, yeah, where you gotta like skateboard up, essentially. They got really creative with that. I'm so happy that Prime 4 is being made. Even though they restarted development. Don't ask me why, but hey. All I care about is that we got a decent game at the end. Okay, now we can check out how this platform behaves. If I don't jump into the abyss. It's gonna do a spinny spin. Please tell me it stays, you don't have to like hit it with the stasis. Alright, perfect. How convenient. Oh shit. Talk about saved by the platform. You gotta be like very immediate. It's a it's a weird grab on mechanic. Cause in most games it's In most games, you know, it's grab it later. Like you have to delay it for a sec. In this game it's almost like straight away. Please tell me this is a shortcut. How nice would it be if I could see whatever. I mean this looks like a shortcut. This feels like a shortcut. Come on, bruh. There we go. Uh, this... I can't tell. Hold on, is there a secret other path? There is a whole other path. What the hell? Bruh. I legit don't know. And I'm scared to go on. All right, let me just, my, my stomach is growling. All right, shut the fuck up, stomach. Don't care about your shit. Because it kind of is dinner time. If you're wondering when I'm recording this video, that's when. Okay, this is a as dead of a dead end as you can get. Which kind of narrows down my options. I really want to get to the next Volgram checkpoint. That's my ambition here. Don't know if it's gonna be fulfilled. Look at this fucking electric Jesus coming down. Okay, that is for sure. No, this is a shortcut. This is where I was. Yeah, that stupid monster is here. But, what this means... Huh. Can you like switch? Oh, you can. I'm pretty sure I wasn't able to access this before. New enemy. Bitch. Actually, he was a bitch. Man, am I gonna be happy to see Volgrim's ass. Not that we necessarily have to look at his ass, but you know. Just in general, the boy Volgrim is gonna come through with the checkpoint hopefully soon. Dodge. Not gonna lie, I'm a pro speed runner at this game, you know. Which one is more likely to. Uh, that's a giant ass monster. 
I'll do the electric boogaloo. In fact, you know what? Just kill it quicker. I feel like out of the abilities, this one is one of the more useful ones. Oh yeah, just do random shit. This one did different stuff than the previous one, right? Like a different set of attacks, it seemed like. Holy shit. Oh, it's just that. Okay. Did you hear the sound go like off there for a second? Okay, this has got to be a shortcut. Look at this normal ass human elevator. Weird, because this is not a... But then what the hell is that path? You know, it did cross my mind that I'm going to teleport right into the hole. Okay, let me just check this out. I, I will call it quits. I don't want to go too long, but... Yeah, I don't think so. What up? Why can I yeet them off the edge like that with this weapon? I should be able to. Question is, can I make that? Let me just heal. Yes, yes, you can. Unfair. I can just like raise his shield. Oh. That did... Nada. But why did it do nothing? Hold on, I just gotta... That horn attack is... Straight up unfair. Is this where I got fucked up by demons? Could be. Except my dodging is too good. As a pro speedrunner, you know. I got them strats. Oh, unfair. I got I got yeeted in the end. You know what? Screw this. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? I thought he was dead. I was like, damn that, damn I killed him quickly. But, I don't know. If you think I'm button mashing, uh, I kind of, first of all, I kind of am. But second of all, I picked up a really bad habit from playing fighting games, which is that you tend to hit every input twice. Like fighting games do that to, you know, to make sure that you got the button, that you hit it. And I kind of, again, picked up the bad habit of doing that. I hit everything twice. I knew it. I knew it. Fuck, I'm right again, as always. Hey, that's looking like a neat area. Oh, is that the destroyer's thing? That does look like the destroyer's thing. Is this is where we're supposed to go? Seems like where, seems like a place where we would need a horse, Fury. I don't know if you happen to have one. All right. I'm just gonna hit this checkpoint. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. I want to thank you guys very much for watching. See, now I'm curious what's on the other end. Man, this game making you choose. Terrible. Although Wrath is supposed to be this way. Yeah, we'll end it here. Thanks for watching and goodbye.